So I'll tell you what we're going to do then. Um, we're going to do one more meditation. Um, and then we'll call it a day. This one is going to be a healing meditation. So um, let me just change my background again. This is called the Memheshin. And traditionally, this is the, the name of God used to summon healing. Uh, let me read this to you really quick. Uh, so uh, hold on a second. It keeps going behind my screen. I can't read it. Okay. Um, the Memheshin healing and neutralizing all diseases provides a healing energy at the deepest level. The name helps to achieve better health, counteracts any type of illness, heals the body and mind, protects against pain, chronic fatigue, and dysfunction, and strengthens the mental health, promotes cleansing, taking responsibility for your current situation, and transferring healing energies uh, to strengthen other people. Now, in, our, in the coaching program, we actually taught you how to create thought forms. Uh, and impregnate thought forms using this particular process. But that's not the purview of this particular uh, training. So we're going to do the Kabbalistic meditation. So th this particular meditation can be done a lot like a Reiki meditation, where you go into state, you create the symbol, the energy beams, you beam the state, the, the symbol through you and out into the world. So this can be used for hands-on healing. This can be used for distance and remote healing. Uh, but the idea, once again, uh, as in just as now, and one of the interesting things about about the Kabbalah that I was trained in is there was only one other discipline that was allowed to be taught in the, in the Kabbalah center where I was, and that was Reiki. And that was because the structure of Reiki was so, so, so similar to the Kabbalistic systems that they were almost the same thing. So we can take, for those of you who are the Reiki background, you can take your Reiki meditation mechanics, apply this symbol and funnel healing energy that way. Okay. So um, let's go ahead and close your eyes. Take a deep breath in. And let that breath out with a sigh. Deeper and deeper with every breath you take and every beat of your heart. I just want you to relax and let go. Listen to the sound of my voice. Any sounds that you hear other than the sounds of my voice are simply the sounds of our natural environment. They're not going to disturb you or distract you in any way. In fact, all they're going to do is signal you, remind you, reinforce inside your mind, body, and soul the fact that you're completely safe, that no matter how far inside you travel, no matter how deep inside you go, you will always, always, always be able to hear my words, follow my instructions, obey my commands, because you realize that everything I say and everything I do is for you, to give you the life and the lifestyle that you want the way that you want it by your standards and your definitions. Now in a moment, not yet, but in just a moment, I'm gonna ask you to focus all of your attention on the lids of your eyes. And I'm gonna ask you to begin to relax those tiny muscles in your eyelids. I want you to continue to relax them more and more and more until they're so relaxed they just don't wanna work anymore. And when you are satisfied, you're convinced, they're so relaxed, they just don't want to work anymore. All I want you to do is give them a quick test just to be sure. And when you're satisfied, stop testing, allow that level of relaxation to flow from the top of your head all the way down to the tips of your toes. Deeper and deeper with every breath you take and every beat of your heart, I just want you to relax and let go. Now in a moment, not yet, but in just a moment, I'm going to ask you to begin to relax your mind just as deeply as we've been relaxing your body. And we're going to do that in a very special way. In a moment, not yet, but in just a moment, I'm going to ask you to begin to imagine the, I'm sorry, to, uh, yeah, to imagine the alphabet backwards, starting with the letter Z. With each and every breath you take and each and every beat of your heart, all I want you to do is relax those letters completely out of your mind. Allow them, if you will, to become smaller and darker harder to see. Turn the volume all the way down, 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 deeper and deeper, down, down, down. Now, obviously, I can't do this for you. Only you can allow this to happen. 
And when you know they're gone and you're as deeply relaxed in your mind as you are in your body, all I want you to do is allow your head to nod with honest unconscious movements to let me know. And we'll continue with the next part of our process. Drifting, dreaming, floating. Smaller, darker, harder to see. Turning the volume all the way down. Down, down, deeper, deeper, down, down, down. That's right. Now in a moment, not yet, but in just a moment, I'm going to ask you to begin to use that amazing imagination of yours that I know that you have. And I'm always wondering, I'm always curious, if you could imagine a place, a place that was so nourishing, so nurturing, so protective, so transformational, so forgiving, so absolutely safe, that no negativity of any kind could exist there for even a fraction of a second without being immediately vaporized or turned into its opposite. I'm curious, I'm wondering, if you could imagine what a place like that might be like. What might you see in that amazing place? What might you hear? What might you smell? What might you taste? Because when you do that, when you're in that place and you see what you see, and you hear what you hear, and you smell and you taste what you smell and you taste, there is an amazing, wonderful, transformational feeling that you get. A feeling that lets you know you're truly safe. And there's a place in your body where those amazing, wonderful feelings start. Where they grow where they spread from, take a moment, point to where you feel that. Now, you may notice that there's a color, maybe even a series of colors connected to those amazing feelings. I'm curious what color of colors that might be for you, first impression. Whatever those colors are, imagine a brilliant ball of that energy floating above your head. Notice how the feelings in your body shift and change as with every breath you take and every beat of your heart, that amazing ball of energy begins to grow, begins to expand, begins to fill the entire room from floor to ceiling, from wall to wall and all points in between. Notice how it wraps itself around you like an amazing blanket of safety, protection, forgiveness, a cocoon, a shield, a suit of armor, insulating you, protecting you from all threats, all dangers, real or imagined, while at the same time flooding your mind, flooding your body, flooding your spirit, with everything it most wants, everything it most needs, in an infinite, ever-expanding, supply. When you know you've got that breathe, those amazing colors through your entire being. Let it fill you up like water fills up a bottle, like fluid fills up a test tube, like hot air helium fills up a balloon. Anchor it in so fully, so completely, no force in the universe. You'll turn it off, take it away, not even you. And when you realize it's true, test it. Try to turn it off, try to take it away. Notice what happens instead. And when you're satisfied, stop testing. Breathe more of that energy through your body. As you breathe more and more of that energy into your body, you can feel your spirit body beginning to swell up with more and more of that energy. You can feel your energy body expanding outward. You can feel your physical body following your spirit body and your energy body. You can feel your soul emanating and radiating outward in all directions. 
with each in breath, that energy gets thicker and thicker in all six directions, forward, backwards, right, left, up, down. Feel that energy flowing deeper and deeper into every level of your mind, body, and soul. When you got that, allow yourself to just sit in that energy. And allow your consciousness to turn inward, back into that place of absolute safety. Because you move back into that place of absolute safety, as you dissolve into it completely, you may begin to notice another energy calling to you from that place. An energy that radiates brightness, healing, restoration and transformation. If you could imagine a place that was so healing, a place that was so healing, that would allow you to experience stronger mental health and cleansing, the healing energy at the deepest level, where anything that will become in contact with this energy was immediately transformed, healed to its greatest potential. I'm curious, if there were a place that was the source of that energy, what might that be like? What might you see in that space? What might you hear? What might you smell? What might you taste? Because when you do that, when you're in that place, and you see what you see, and you hear what you hear, and you smell and you taste what you smell and you taste, there's an amazing, wonderful feeling that you get. A feeling of absolute transformational healing. And there's a wonderful place in your body where those amazing feelings start. Where they grow and where they spread from. Take a moment. Point to where you feel it. Notice there's a color. Maybe even a series of colors connected to those amazing feelings. I'm curious what color of colors that might be for you, first impression. Whatever that color is. I want you to breathe those amazing energies through your entire being. Let it fill you up like water fills up a bottle, like fluid fills up a test tube, like hot air helium fills up a balloon. Anchor it in so fully, so completely, no force in the universe can turn it off or take it away. Not even you. And when you know you've got that, once again, Breathe those energies through the center core of your body, down through your heart, into your lower dantian, where they form the shape of the Hebrew letters Mem, He, Shin. And if you're not sure what those look like, you can allow your eyes to open and notice the shapes on your screen. And notice how the feelings in your body shift and change as that energy begins to take on that shape to take on that substance, begins to emanate and radiate and radiate in all directions, filling up your lower Dantian with a magnificent reservoir of healing energy. And as that energy continues to fill and overflow, it moves up your center core into your heart, forming another Memhe Shi, emanating from your heart center, front, back, right, left, up, down, purging all darkness, all shadow, all disease, all ill health, all patterns that are not healthy for you in any way, shape, or form, replacing it with infinite, brilliant, divine light. And when you know you've got that, allow that energy to travel up into the center of your head where it forms yet another Mem Heishin. And notice how the feelings in your body shift and change as the divine letters emanate radiate, purging all darkness, all shadow, all disease, all ill health, all negative patterns from your mind, your body, your soul, your spirit. And as you allow those energies to flow, notice how they begin to pulse from top to bottom, from bottom to top. All three men, machines vibrating, emanating, 
circulating, sending wave after wave after wave of brilliant, transforming healing energy through your mind, your body, your soul. And as that energy ripples out into the world in an infinite, ever-expanding and unlimited supply, your vessel, mind, body, soul, spirit, physical body, completely saturated with that energy. The more you pull in and share, the more you have. The more healing you share, the more healing you receive. When you're ready, imagine now a beautiful ball of that menheshin floating up from your heart to your heart. From your heart, it flows down into your stomach sheds its brilliant, brilliant light into your stomach and your spleen and your pancreas. Purging all shadow, all darkness, all negativity. Restoring it to the perfect blueprint that nature intended. And when that part of you is completely filled and saturated, notice how the feelings in your body shift and change as that energy moves into your lungs. Permeating, emanating, radiating, filling your lungs with infinite love. When your lungs are completely saturated, filled with that light, the energy travels down into your lower dantian again, emanates even more strongly, and then it begins to radiate into your kidneys. <laughs> emanating, filling your kidneys with infinite healing light, restoring, revitalizing, rejuvenating. And then that energy travels from your kidneys into your liver, your gallbladder, filling that energy, filling that space with infinite radiant light, purging all rage, frustration, guilt, resentment, timidity, fear. And brilliant radiance fills that organ, restoring it to perfect health. And then the energy travels back into your heart, from your heart down into your lower dantian. And it begins to emanate outward, filling the entire room with that infinite healing energy. And as you allow that energy to emanate and radiate through every level of your mind, body, and soul, allow yourself to simply dissolve into it while I remain quiet for a while. Very good. Now, like a snow globe that has been shaken, just like all the little flakes begin to settle to the bottom, allow all the energy that you've accumulated in all of your bodies to begin to settle, to flow down your center core through your heart 
into your lower Dantian, where it all settles and pools, forming a vast, unlimited reservoir of healing energy, energy that you can call upon whenever you want to, whenever you need to. When all the energy is settled into the lower Dantian, extend your hands out, palms towards the floor. Breathe in, imagine breathing in earth energy into your palms. As your hands rise up towards the heavens, breathe in heaven chi. As you accumulate the earth and heaven chi, exhale down through your center core, pushing all that energy down into your lower Dantian and sealing that healing energy in on tap and on call whenever you need it. When you've got that, once again, breathe in earth chi, heaven chi. Exhale down into your lower Dantian. Breathe in earth chi, heaven chi. Exhale down, sealing that energy. In a moment, not yet, but in just a moment, I'm going to count from one to five. As I reach the number five, you can emerge from this process. Realizing you can come back to this place, to this energy, to this vibration, anytime you want to, anytime you need to, to restore yourself, to tap into that healing power that you've been resonating with, to use it as needs fit. Number one, feel yourself returning to this place we call reality bringing with you a deeper one. Number two, all of my suggestions from me to you, from you to your own other than conscious mind are now 10 times more powerful, a hundred times more permanent, a thousand times more thrilling, fulfilling, and satisfying than ever before. Embraced, held, locked into that part of your mind, body, and soul that most wants, desires, can implement, facilitate, and express these changes in all the ways that give you the life that you want, the way that you want it, by your standards and your definitions. Number three, because there's always at least three ways to overcome any situation, obstacle, or circumstance that you may face. There's always at least three solutions to any problem you need to solve, and you're all powerful other than conscious mind. Well, now easily, effortlessly, and automatically generate those solutions and implement them in the quickest, easiest, most effective way for the good of yourself and all concerned. Number four, because it's all for you. You've made the investment, you've made the journey, you've followed the instructions, you've obeyed the commands, you've tested the results. You've certainly earned the rewards and the right to keep them. It's your reality, it's your truth, it's your life, and you get to live it to the fullest, starting now. On the next count, you can emerge from this process. Head clear, mind clear, heart clear, soul clear, thinking, feeling, acting with self-assurance, feeling good all over, glad to be alive, ready to thrive. Number five, take your time, come on back. Notice how good you feel.